And pardoning power is on President Trump's mind this morning. Just moments ago, he said this, while all agree the U.S. president has the complete power to pardon, why think of that when only crime so far is leaks against us, fake news? This comes days after the Washington Post reported President Trump is trying to understand the limits of his power as president to pardon. They raised the possibility of, of the president pardoning advisors and family members and even himself. It's relevant in light of the ongoing special counsel investigation into Russian election meddling, of course, and possible collusion with the Trump campaign. So Yodit Tawaldi, a criminal defense attorney and former prosecutor, is with us now. I want to play, or I want to read to you here real quickly, uh, an email from, from John Dowd, um, who tries to explain the, the power of, of the pardons here. Um, and it, actually, the, the Russian, the parameters with which uh, the Russian investigation can go. He says, those transactions are, in my view, well beyond the mandate of the special counsel, are unrelated to the election of 2016 or any alleged collusion between the Trump campaign and Russia, and most importantly, are well beyond any statute of limitations imposed by the U.S. Code. Basically saying, uh, if this investigation would bleed into um, the president's finances or his business relationships, that could be going too far. But how expansive are the parameters, Yodit? that the uh, special counsel has empowered uh, or is empowered to, to penetrate? I mean, you know what, with this whole, um, you know, uh, looking into uh, Paul Manafort's finances and his, and his tax um, records, that opens the door up for the president as well. And, it can, and right now he is um, given the power as special counsel to look into what he needs to um, get answers. And that includes Donald Trump's finances. So he can't say, you know what, you can look into everybody else's, but you can't look into mine. He is the president of the United States. So I, his, his power to do so is, is, is expansive, for sure. Okay, does, does, the pa does the president, though, a lot of people are wondering, does he have the power to pardon himself? He, he doesn't, does he? So, so, so the Constitution gives the president the power to pardon people for federal crimes, mm -hmm. and generally the courts have um, upheld those pardons. However, my interpretation of the power to pardon is that you give that to the benefit of others. So there's a grantor, the president, and then you have the recipient, other people, not yourself. 